hey guys what's up welcome back to another video so in this video i'm going to show you how to containerize your spring boot app using docker and build and run in your browser so first thing i'm just going for spring initializer here and let me quickly write the group name or zoom and artifact id and let me add dependency here spring web and just generate so let me go for the generated file here okay let me extract it somewhere uh, maybe in desktop okay i will extract in my desktop and let me close everything so let's go for intelize and just go for open and in my desktop here is booting wave so let's click ok and next thing is you need to install the docker so for that just type sudo apt install docker dot io and just enter your password if you are doing it for the first time it will it might take some time to install so i've already installed so it's not taking any time just type hi docker version to check if docker is installed or not so if it shows the version like this your docker is installed in your ubuntu system so let me close everything from here and let me quickly go to my Spring Boot app and let me go for the resources here and inside the static file I want to just create one HTML file and let me call it index.html so let me give the title booting web and just type something okay this is me or Zoom or something like that you can type anything and just save this one and next thing is you need to create one docker file inside the booting web so I'm just going to create one docker file docker file and just type enter and you need to give some of the configurations just type from maven and just type the version of maven install in the Ubuntu system just type mbn hyphen hyphen version and I have got 3.6.3 so, so if you haven't installed maven just type sudo apt get install maven so maven will be installed and just try the version 3.6.3 and just type the version of your java so I have got java 11 so I will type 11 here and build builder okay builder so I will be providing this uh, configuration file inside my description so you can just copy from there and just change some of the things according to your app so I'll just type arg version equals 0 0.0.1 .0 so this is from pom.xml if you go here and see the version of snapshot 0 0.0.1 so let me type the same thing here snap sort here snap sort and just type work directory and build and just copy your pom dot pom dot xml file into build also copy source file into build dot src also you can just type run mvn clean package copy and copy this type target slash booting web this is from the artifact id booting web group id or you can say artifact id and this type hyphen and version just type dot jar and target slash application dot jar and next thing is you need to provide the version of java so i have open jdk so if you just check here java hyphen version you can see it's open jdk 11.0.11 .11. so i will just type the same thing 11.0.11 .11. And just type JRE and slim. 
okay I just need to clear this one okay and also just type work directory app and type copy from builder build slash target slash application application dot jar slash app and next thing is you need to just type command java hyphen jar slash app slash application application dot jar so let me recheck this one it looks fine so you can just type same thing and just change the if you have different app you can just change the name and if you have different maven version and java version you can change accordingly but everything other than that is similar and let me go to the terminal and let me navigate to the booting web so this is my spring boot app and my location and here you need to type sudo docker hyphen t and just type the name of your app so it's booting web and just type dot so if i click enter and enter my password this looks um okay you need to type build also okay i forgot to type build so docker and just type build and click enter so this will install some of the dependencies and this might take some time to install so, so i will be skipping the video so it has finished installing the dependencies here so it shows some error like this so if we are getting this kind of error just type maven clean package so this should clear your error so let me just type that one and again I type the same command sudo docker build hyphen t booting so you can see here it's showing another error here copy failed start build target okay it's showing error in 10th step so you can see here i have got some type mistake here so let me correct this one target and let me run the same thing again now it should work i guess yeah it's working successfully built so it's built successfully here so the next thing is i need to run this file so just type sudo docker run hyphen p at at and just type same thing at at hyphen d and just type the name of your application booting wave and just type enter so this should create some image here and if i go to my browser and just type localhost 8080 so this should show my index.html content here so it's working fine and next thing is you need to just type docker.ph just type sudo before docker docker ps and if you see here this is the image container id so if you want to stop the docker just type docker ps sorry docker stop and just paste the image id so if i type enter so again i forgot to type the sudo so sudo and if you type sudo docker stop and this should stop our docker running the file so let's wait for some time and if i go here and again enter the same thing this should so the site can be reached so this is how you containerize your spring boot app and build and run thank you so much for watching don't forget to like and subscribe my channel thank you